Good morning. You know, there's nothing better in the morning time to start off with two things. The Bible and Dunkin'. <laughs> you know, about two years ago, I didn't even drink coffee at all. Actually, I drank a lot of Coca-Cola, which now I don't drink Coca-Cola at all. Um, like I say, God delivered me from that. And um, But anyways, I was in uh, Mount Juliet, Tennessee, and um, with a pastor friend of mine up there, uh, Pastor Greg Locke. And he took me to Duncan. And anybody that knows him, he drinks a lot of Duncan, okay? And um, and I now drink a lot of Duncan. But anyways, I went with him to Duncan Donuts, and I got a coffee, and I kind of listened to how he got his coffee. And um, anyways, I tried it up there, and I actually liked it up there. And then I come back here, and I just never could get it right. Anyways, one day my wife is ordering something with this butter pecan. So now I go to Duncan. This is no joke, guys. I get seven shots of butter pecan. Something about the number seven. Seven shots of, or seven things of sugar, seven shots of milk. And this morning I got one shot of espresso. I don't normally do that, but it's Easter Sunday, so I need that little extra, you know, pick me up. I'm pretty tired. I was up late last night. But anyways, guys, it's great in the morning time. First off, you want to start off every morning with your prayer. And then get into your word. Spend some time, a long time with God. That one-on-one -on -one time. But today is Easter Sunday, okay? And it doesn't matter to me if you go to church every Sunday. I'm not that pastor who's going to get the pulpit and tell you, oh, you know, you'll go to you know, once a year, people. Listen, if you go to church only once a year, amen. Go to church today, okay? Listen, you are one service, one Sunday, one prayer to an entire different life. Guys, all the problems that we face on this earth, all the issues... One day, very soon, Jesus Christ himself is going to come back for his bride. And guys, we got to be ready. We got to be prepared. So come to church. It's a good start, guys. It's a good start on the beginning of your relationship with Christ. You know, in Matthew 6, he says, Seek ye first the kingdom of God. You know, I never talk about the second part of that verse because people focus on the second part of it. They need to focus on the first part of it. Seek ye first the kingdom of God. He'll take care of all the rest, but just seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness. It's so important, guys, that we understand that we are not in this alone and that we have God Almighty. He's literally right there for us. And the Bible says that he is for us. Who can be against us? But you got to learn it, guys. you got to seek him. God bless y'all. And happy Resurrection Sunday. He is risen. He is alive. And I hope to see y'all this morning at church.